told me, no, you're totally fine. Hello, what's up? I'm the Thought Bad Doom here doing another video for you guys, and this time it's a live stream of the Star Wars 501st Legion Clone Trooper. So I got this in an unboxing that will be on the TG101 channel, but I figured I'm going to do the live build here anyways, because there's another thing on that uh, video that I'm going to show off that I am super happy about, super excited about, uh, but uh, we're going to build this on the live stream. So yes, it's the 501st. Legion Clone Troopers, I know it's a big deal with the whole community, but I've always wanted Clone Troopers for LEGO Star Wars, and I never got Clone Troopers. I've had Battle Droids, but never Clone Troopers. So, finally, I decide, let's go ahead and grab it. Um, uh, with that way, uh, yeah. <laughs> I love these Clone Troopers already, because they look cool, you know, with their design and details. Even though I'm just looking at Taking a look at the actual set. Still, the pictures look good. And yes, I know it's still a lot. We could have just had multiple clone troopers and we would have been fine. But uh, I, I think it's a nice valued pack. And also, I got this for $6 less than normal price. It is a little beat up at the top there, but who cares? We're going to open it anyways. What? This isn't Halo. What? This isn't Transformers. What? This isn't Bionicle. I actually was into LEGO Star Wars for a while. Um, I don't know why I stopped. I think I was just too focused on other things, but, uh, yeah. Let's see, is that bag one? I know there's two bags. But, uh, yeah, it's, it's not like the, the sets are bad, it's just I thought. Eh, I got other Transformers and whatnot going on. Let's go ahead and build this set. Okay, so this is bag one, this is a smaller bag, this is a much bigger bag. Look at the difference of parts. Maybe it's just smaller parts. We got the instructions, and of course we got a sticker sheet. Uh, stickers, uh, I don't like that. Uh, it seems like I get a lot of Lego sets early in the year. Oh god, this is all flat, and it feels new. But uh, we're gonna tear this side open. But yeah, I, I used to try and buy a bunch of these. Uh, for the longest time I had no uh, battle droids or stormtroopers or anything like that. And uh, now I have a few, which is kind of funny, because I had the original Boba Fett. Okay, come on. I should open this up a little bit wider, but I don't want the pieces to start flying, so uh, let's see. Oh, that's why. There's another bag inside there. Okay. Come on. There we go. Of course, I'm going to hold off on opening the second bag, because they're all numbered, and why would we want to mix that up? But uh, there's a bunch of parts. There's probably some common LEGO parts in this that uh, I've never owned, just because of uh, how I collect LEGO. I'm not a, a super big collector of LEGO. Like, um, uh, this ski part right here, I've never owned that. Uh, let's see. Okay. First time owning a Clone Trooper helmet. These things look cool. I would love to see them do more uh, Clone Trooper stuff. Which uh, is a good thing that Clone Wars is kind of relevant. Hell, it's still kind of relevant because we've got um, uh, the Bad Batch coming out. Okay. Uh, I missed something. Okay, I thought something was wrong. All right, so those are the small bags. We're going to open up the instructions and see exactly what we're doing. I might try to hurry this up and not take too much time out of this. Okay, uh, are they both the same clone troopers? Yes, so it doesn't really matter which configuration we've got. Uh, that plugs onto there, and then we've got the uh, the face. we got to plug on the clone trooper face, you know. And then we got the helmet that goes over top, and there's one of the clone troopers. We gotta give him a weapon. But Lego doesn't have weapons. Yeah, you sure about that? And that's my first clone trooper ever built. Took a while, didn't it? <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, the first stormtrooper I got was actually the... Um, uh, the two-pack, and it's a stormtrooper pilot, technically, so I don't know if that really counts for anything. I, I love Star Wars for the, the movies, but I don't go too deep into the lore and stuff. I'm more of the casual fan. 
as they're called. There's the other stormtrooper. Very cool. I like how they got all the same weapon piece, or at least for the most part, they got all the same weapon piece. So no confusion with that. Very cool. All right, now we got some droids. Now, these I know what to do. Even though it's very confusing because their arms are different now because they finally straighten them out. Yeah, those sideways arm things are uh, really weird. Trying to find the other sideways arm. Okay, so let's see. The thicker side goes on top. Damn, boy, she's thick. And then we got the head. And uh, yeah, I don't have any droids built in my collection right now because the arms broke, but uh, I've I've had droids. There we go. Uh, two pack. It was the uh, not Hoth. It was um, crate. It was for the Last Jedi. So it's pretty sad that my first stormtrooper was thanks to the Last Jedi, a movie that I don't really hate that as much as everyone else does, but I'm, I, I won't say it's good. I'll just say I don't hate it as much as other people. It takes me a while to realize the flaws in, in movies. Like I, I don't watch them for the first time right away to see all the flaws. I'll watch that. I'll watch for that later, but I'd like to enjoy a movie at least once. Like, uh... Wonder Woman 84. There's a lot of problems with that. I still won't say it's a bad movie overall, but there are flaws, and I'm like, eh, that's questionable. All right, let's go ahead and build a Lego thing. We're supposed to do that now. All right. God, these instructions are too basic for me sometimes compared to some of the Mega Constructs. Some of the Mega Constructs uh, sets, like... For, for this set, I know I'm going to make a lot of comparisons. God, that thing is... A little too big. Um, but I, I do collect a lot of the Mega Construct stuff. So you are going to hear that. Um, oh, maybe you're curious what, what people from the other side think. But anyways. Uh, for a Mega Construct's Halo set at least. You build a base and it uses like 10, 15 parts already. This says like, okay, get one plate. You got the first step done. Congratulations. All right, I will get to the chat. Uh, they've invented straightened arms back during the years before the complete saga came out, I think. Yeah, but my first... Uh, my, my only other droid set that I ever got was that original battle pack. And I have some of the parts to it. It's got that little brown speeder thing. Um, but yeah, that was my first entry into the these droids which is funny because i actually also own the original droidicas uh let's see so i'm trying to find that one piece that's angled off on the side oh there it is but yeah i've been uh buying a little bit more lego oh you know what i should also mention the uh binocle anniversary thing you know the 90th anniversary of lego and uh a lot of people are suggesting that we should do Bionicle because of its anniversary. And I get why some Lego fans or, you know, the brick-based style fans are a little disappointed by that because it doesn't feel like a 90th anniversary set. Because, yes, Bionicle at some point, I guess you can argue, did save Lego at a point. But... Lego doesn't do that as often, and that type of set doesn't really sell as much as it did back in the day. For a 90th anniversary set, you'd think of a set that would celebrate throughout the various years, you know, something that's major that uh, pretty much anyone can get into. And as much as, you know, I know people who are into Bionicle, I also know people who are into Bionicle as well as Lego Space and Lego Castle and all this and that. So I totally understand why people are upset by that. But what I will say is this. We don't have anything going on right now. Uh, as far as Bionicle fans, we don't have anything for our anniversary set. You know, we, we never got one for the 20th anniversary of Bionicle, or at least so far we haven't really. Um, I've got to lower the camera just a bit, just so that you can properly see what I'm doing. 
Um, but yeah. And with that said, we all know that even in the 90th anniversary toy line, a Bionicle set would not be the only anniversary set they would do. I mean, Lego makes hundreds and hundreds of sets every year. So to think that one set is going to be the 90th anniversary, then they're just not going to do anything else. I don't know. I feel like that's definitely not what's going to happen. Um, and uh, with that said, if that's the case, then this is the only ch chance Bionicle really has for that. So I, I, I just want to make it clear. I do get why some Lego fans would be upset, but I don't think it's the end of the world. Plus, also, I see people say that, oh, Bionicle is not real Lego. I don't know. It's got the Lego brand. It uses Lego parts because, you know, it's official Lego. And a lot of the parts from the Bionicle sets also get transferred into some of the mainline sets or some of the other Lego themes. So, huh, I think it's Lego and saying that is kind of stupid. But, uh, you know, that's just me. You know, what do I know? <laughs> but anyways, um, what was my other point? Is that, oh, and I saw someone get upset because, um, uh, what was it? Sorry, I'm also concentrating on building this. Because of a, a Bionicle set could win in general, and that should not happen. Okay, well, man, it's really unfortunate that some other people could get something, and it's not like you have a billion other Lego sets to choose from that you can go out and buy. Oh, but Bionicle, our precious Bionicle would ruin that. You know, would demonize that. Hi, are you... Mod for the domain, and how are you? Yes, I am. Uh, late brain attack. Oh, yeah, brain attack. Uh, those creature things were kind of cool. I have uh, one of them uh, complete at the moment. Okay, so we need a number three sticker. I, I don't mean to go on a rant. I just saw so many people say, Yeah, don't do Bionicle. You know, they don't do, they don't say that about any other theme but Bionicle. Don't do Bionicle. It's just like, wow, you know, there, there's so many themes in the community that, uh, you, you know, you couldn't really open up to this community. And, and they'll say, oh, God, that sticker's messed up. I'm not good with stickers. Um, Bionicle fans are the mo most toxic. Okay, well, why are you guys the ones complaining about, you know, a whole community of people right now? Because they want something. I don't know. Okay, this is the piece that I feel is going to be an absolute nightmare to do. Uh, okay, so sticker number one. I have no idea how the hell I'm supposed to do this. Sorry, this is off camera, but I mean, how else? Okay. Sorry, I need concentration as I'm doing these stickers. Ogram. Uh, no. Oh, was someone asking him? I know that you got most of that green and brown one from Brain Attack. Just not sure about the uh, the hands. I saw the pictures and uh, I noticed that the hands were missing out of that. Okay, that sticker really messed up, but whatever. Again, I'm not perfect when it comes to stickers. I just want to get them on. Uh, let's see. Okay, so the last one is, is it number 10? Yeah, it's number 10. Okay. This one I do kind of want to line up with the blue, though. Yeah, I didn't really do a good job, but whatever. Stickers are on there. Not good, but whatever. Doesn't look as bad as I thought it was going to be. For some reason, it's not sticking at the bottom here. But whatever. And I, I'm sorry that I'm missing the chat quite a bit. It's just <laughs> I really want to get this set done because I've got uh, other videos to edit. I've got an unboxing to do on my main channel uh, for Transformers, so T Fan Page 101. 
And then I've got an unboxing on this channel that's coming out soon. Hopefully right after this live stream. I still got to edit that, but it uh, shouldn't take too long to edit. Uh, let's see. So we've got the handlebars. Uh, let's see. I can't believe I got this for $6 less than normal. Because this is a tricky set to come by when it first released. And it's probably one of the best sellers for LEGO right now. And yet... And there we go. I like the handlebars for that. That's pretty cool. Why is it so bright on the, the picture right now? There we go. Okay. Um, what was I saying? Uh, yeah, I can't believe I got this for $6 less than normal. Okay. So I'm going to put the stickers off to the side because I don't think we need those for a while. Uh, let's see. We got bricks. We got bricks, ladies and gentlemen. We've got bricks. I do like these bricks with the vents on the side. I think they're pretty cool. Especially the fact that they got them zigzagged in different directions. So you can choose from whatever direction you want, just from one piece. Okay. See how quick that was? This is easy stuff compared to mega constructs. I'm not even saying that to be mean to Lego, by the way, when I was talking about that. Because uh, I do like to point some simplicity that Lego has. So then, you know, you'll get certain sets that are a little more complex compared to other things. I, I get it. Not every set is going to be the same. But I, I do notice that there is there's a different feel of its construction when you when you open a, a mega constructs halo thing. You know, it, this set feels very different than a Warthog. And I'm not just talking about the shape. I'm talking about how it's done. Because, I mean, obviously this isn't a Warthog. Um, let's see. Wait, 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 wait. Whoa, 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 wow. Don't know why I did that. That was pretty annoying. And this will slide into there with that little ratchet joint in there. I don't buy Mega Constructs, so that's fine. You don't have to. It's just It just means that you betrayed everything I know and love. I mean, it's your money, so you do whatever you want. If you want to betray me, go ahead. There we go. I'm liking the design of this. It's just, it's just very big. All right, so let's see. Uh, I've never had these three... Uh, times there are three whatever three peg long tiles. Uh, let's see. That plugs in there and plugs onto the side. Oh, and I forgot to attach this. I've had these launcher pieces before. I don't think I've had the brick based ones on a set, but I've got them before from uh, from other means. I got that theme stuck in my head now. Oh, I just realized you guys probably did see a part of that haul that I was talking about earlier. Because uh, on my Instagram page, if anyone's on that... You will see me post that, hey, I got part of this collection now. Woohoo. And I'm one figure away from finishing that off. Woo. <laughs> don't know why the instructions don't just tell you do this on both sides. There we go. I don't have Instagram. That's fine. Hey, can you read my question? What is your favorite set from the infinite wave of Mega Constructs? Uh, that would be the Pelican Inbound. There is no competition with that right now. I know that's a big set, and I don't like saying that because some people will not be able to afford that, and I totally understand. You know, I'm not, you know, bagging on anyone for that. It's just how it is. You know, growing up, I couldn't afford every 
Lego Mega Blocks whatever set. But um, I, ca I can't deny that uh, there is a certain fondness to that set. There's that. Mmm, a stormtrooper with skis. Have you ever heard of such a thing? Mmm. Actually, I think I have these ski pieces in another set. Or did they make them different in another set? Did they change them up? I don't remember. Uh, also, I'm seeing lightsaber rods. So I'm guessing we'll be using those. Oh, yeah, for the back guns. I forgot about that. All right, so we need those little one-by-ones with the pegs in the middle. And those will plug onto the side here, like so. I do apologize if I'm not reading the chat too much. I've got a lot of stuff going on today, so I just want to get this going. Uh, WandaVision is coming out. I can't believe people... I can't believe the complaints for that, by the way. Uh, like, if you don't like the show in general, that's fine. That's that, that's up to you, you know? I'm not going to make you want to like the show. Also, I forgot to add another one of these. I'm not going to make you like the show. You know, if you have your opinion, that's fine. But then people seem to be upset because there's a lot of fighting. Well, that's not really the point of the show. Not everything is supposed to be, you know, pew, pew, fight, fight. Pew, pew. You know, sometimes we can sit back and relax. But it's not only that, it's the suspense of the show. There's something going on in the neighborhood. And it's freaking everyone out. Although I feel like everyone just kind of clued in as to what the issue is. All right, so we've got that. Oh my God, there's a bunch of these little bullet things that you can use. Stop being drunk, clone trooper. Almost said storm trooper, but you are a clone. Why are they? Why? Why are the storm troopers later on not referred to as clones? Well, gee, maybe that's why they dropped the name clone trooper. What am I missing here? Oh, okay, this was part of the seat, and I forgot. Oopsie poopsie. Here we go. All right, so now we got this little clone trooper. I could sit right here. Pretty sure his weapon can go somewhere, but uh, I'm just going to leave it there for right now. And there he is! Now he could go... Okay. Oh, <laughs> I was wondering what you were talking about. Uh, okay, so we got those, and then these spare parts can go, I don't know, right around this corner here. Look at the droids, they're just having a conversation. Roger. Roger, Roger. Roger, Roger. Roger. More bags, more minifigures. Yes. Mm. All right, so I'm just going to take out the two smaller bags. There's two this time. I was thinking, hey, is this the first time I've had the jetpacks? It is not. I've had the jetpack with a Django, or not Django, a Boba Fett. And I'm not sure if it's the same one that came with the first one, but I do have that concept. God, the lighting on this video is ugh, everywhere. But uh, the concept version of Boba Fett, the one in white, I have that on the booklet. I actually have that beside me. I'm going to grab it right now. So yeah, that one. I love that. Uh, can I just stand him up? There we go. Couldn't see where I was putting him. All right. It's time to slam jam. Everybody on the slam jam. Everybody slam jam. Break your knees at the slam jam. All right. Hey, two by three plate. Never had that before. It's just new experiences all around. Okay. So we got to do something about these troopers. Uh, let's see. The helmets are going to be different from what I can recall. Yes, those one. That one has red markings. I'm just trying to separate them so that uh, you know they're on different sides. I believe that the legs are the same and. Faces are the same, so we're going to attach that over top. Bring this head in. Plug that there. 
plug that there. And then this one's going to have a different weapon this time. But before we do that, I want to plug on this guy. And plug that over the top. Ooh, felt like that was going to break that. There we go. I love that commander guy. Commander Shepard. Plug that there. And then last one's going to be him because he gets a candlestick on his weapon. Uh, is his? Yeah, his is the longer rifle. So I got to find that. There it is. I like the idea of using the candlestick as the front thing. There we go. So now he could properly stand. And we've got a clone army! Now we got to build a walker. Of course, we're walking. Come on, here's the other one. Sorry, I'm just trying to find certain parts I didn't realize. Hey! I'm not talking. Let's see. We're gonna need four of these. Don't know why they have to specifically pinpoint four. Okay, then we've got this. Man, I wish I got a lot more Exaforce. Uh, this set is actually the AT 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 T T A A, -A, -A Big Titty is the Big Titty Mobile. I never said this video was for kids. All right, so we got these flat tiles that have to go right here and connect the spaces. To rise against the stones above us, uh, whoever we are. Ooh, are those the metallic ones? Yes, they are. Which means if we got a spare, we can walk around and play Lego video game. Ow! I just pulled out my hair. There it is. Don't know if you can see it, but it's there. Hmm. Looking for another one of those dish parts. Don't know why I made it sound like a song. I am really hoping that the Slave 1 set is real, because I wanted to get the original one, just to have that set, but uh, unfortunately I, I missed out on it. Just bad timing, and I didn't really think of it too much after it got released, so I was like, ah, darn, I knew I was missing something. But now it's like, there's a new one. Sure, I'll buy it. Especially if it's cheaper. Cool Lego? Yes. We got eight people watching and I'm ignoring them all? Oh no! I do apologize if I'm ignoring you guys. It's just I want to get this set done. But I also want to do a build because if I don't, my mommy is going to cry. There we go. Okay, so we got that in. Thought that was going to be a lot more difficult than it was, but no, it's not. I don't know if you guys are talking about a specific Lego set or not. I feel like I missed something. Oh, I don't remember ever having this. Unless it has the new Boba. Yeah, uh, I would like to get the new Boba Fett, but I don't really care, because uh, I just want a Boba Fett that's not just the, you know, other one I got. You know, the one I showed off earlier. Uh, let's see, we're going to need another one of these. Uh, 
You know what, though? I will say this. This is one 501st Trooper pack that got away from Ryan. Ha ha ha! If you want to see it again. <laughs> Don't know why I made that noise with my mouth. <sighs> Sounds weird. This is not an ASMR, I swear. I do like this. This reminds me of a lot of the little Lego mini racer sets. Yeah, we still have quite a bit to go. We haven't even built the legs yet. Uh, is this? Yeah, it's this piece. And that will plug over top. Go right into there. I don't even have a drink right now. I should have thought about that before coming in. Okay. Okay, this will plug right underneath here, like so. I also love these uh, ATST, whatever they are. Can't remember all the names of Star Wars. It's it's been so long. I'm more of a casual fan myself. Although I did realize that the one chick from Star Wars, the Clone Wars, did show up in Star Wars, the Mandalorian, so that's cool, I guess. So this will plug all the way through. There we go. And now we have part of a head, and this will just plug right into there. Like so. See, at this scale, they should do the uh, ATST, whatever. Oh my god, I freaked out when I saw it, when I heard Thrawn. I wasn't sure if I should say that because, hey, you spoiled the show, but it's been around for a while. If you're a huge Star Wars fan, you probably saw about it already. But uh, man, as soon as I heard that name, I flipped. My first question was not about Thrawn so much as Ezra. What happened to Ezra? Oh, God. We're almost at sticker time again. Ugh. But at least that's not a sticker. So you, you had to use stickers for everything else. But no, that console gets away with it. That plugs over top of here. Well, it doesn't really want to, so I feel like I'm missing something. Yes, I am. Why is that the second time I missed out on that? There we go. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. Okay, so we got that. We need this little clip piece. It's a clip-on. You get it because ties. Now, is she looking for Thrawn to find Ezra? Now, that's the question. Hmm. Spread his chin. Coughs in hand. It feels like there's still so much to do. So much to do, so much to see. Okay, so we got stickers. Yay, sticker time. Oh, yay. Boo. Let's see. So that will connect up to the top there. So I want to get this as close to the top as I want to. You know, it's funny. I say I'm bad with stickers, but I got that Speed Champions Camaro, and I actually did a pretty decent job with that. I, I lined up a lot of the stickers on that set pretty well. Oop, 
I, I thought I took that off. I didn't. Surprise myself. Uh, let's see. So that goes this way. Trying to center that. Yeah, whatever. Yes, All Star Shrock. Yes, the the famous. Oh God, that's really off. The famous movie Shrock. Donkey. Somebody once told me the world is macaroni. We're getting ahead of ourselves. <sighs> Go. You're watching Clone Wars now? Not my content. Not my thousands of hours of entertainment. Okay. Now we put on some 501st stickers. This is where things get really interesting. Uh, but uh, this is where the Clone Wars. Joe, I don't care about Clone Wars. I'm a Star Wars Rebel fan myself. There we go. Now we got to get one for the other side. My internet on my phone has been messing up. And I don't know what's with me and stickers today. You know what it is? I think I'm just in an awkward position right now. Uh, I got a camera in front of me, and so I have to kind of go crooked and look over what I'm doing. But uh, hopefully you guys are still there. I'm trying to line these ones up. It's a little tricky to do so. There we go. There we are. So we got something going on there. I'm really hoping that people are still able to watch the content right now. You guys let me know in the chat if you guys can still watch this. All right. Clip that on, swing that up, and now we got some fancy little antennas. Okay. And so we got to put on binoculars. And uh, last but not least, we got to put on that one big blue piece on the top. And then we're done with the top. Not done overall. Ah! Yeah, screw it. I'll just say it's bow damage and every part is all weird. But there's the head. Are we done with stickers? No, not yet. Oh. I gotta hook this thing on. There we go. All right, legs. Let's do those. All right, and then we plug on a plug on. We add on a sticker here. So this is number five. They're both number fives. This one has a lot of blank space, so it doesn't really matter if you get it right. But what I like to gotten it even. And I plugged that on the wrong side. So this is actually going to be the other side of the leg. And we'll just build another one, I guess. I put on the ratchet side at the bottom. 
not realizing I made a mistake. Okay, the chat's... Oop. That's not working, I guess, or something. Oh, this was supposed to go down here. Uh, whatever. I don't, I don't care at this moment. Uh, let's see. Ooh, he's also coming gray. I should just do both sides opposite from each other. I mean, that's what they're going to be. Uh, let's see. Did I just forget to put these on? Yeah, I think I forgot to put these on. All right. There we go. So now it's got something there. In which people will stop saying, Hey, you did that wrong. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay, hold on. At least I got them on the opposite side. I think I messed that up. Okay, so, no. Oh, I see what I'm doing. Okay. See, it's kind of weird because uh, one of the pages is overlapping uh, my camera. So, I got confused what the hell is going on here. Plug those in like so. Just gonna plug those in like so. And then plug these over onto the back of here. So I think that will plug onto this side like that. This will plug onto that side like that. And so we got some legs going on. And then the feet. Okay, so the feet are both going to be the same, so that's not gonna be too tricky. these I do hope that the stream's still going on well, let's see do, 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 do. after this I will have to head out quickly so uh yeah, I won't have time to just sit around and be like, hey, what's up, everyone? Sorry, I had to check something. There we go. I'm glad that it's got some silver in it. I am missing one of the ratchet pieces or hinge pieces. There it is. that you gotta make some toes i'm sorry that i get so quiet at the end here it's just i, I want to get this finished so badly Okay, so we got all this, and then we plug the bond like feet. And yes, I do know that I missed putting on the top thing. I will do that. I will fix it. There we go. And there we go. And then after this, it's just we got to put on some dishes, some satellite. Plug this on top of here so he can get some sweet kicks. And fold these forward like that. So, you know, it's a walker. 
like the name implies. There you go. Let me bring that up. Man, so far this is a really good value set. Uh, let's see. Okay, so this will plug onto the dish and plug over top of here, like so. And I'll just do the same thing to the other side because, well, there's no sense in being like, go to the next step and do same. All right, and then these will plug right here, like so. Just to add... Oh, you know what? I completely forgot about that Star Wars Episode 3 set that was pretty much like this. And then that will plug into there. The funny part is, if you want these in metallic, you can go ahead and do so. And there it is! The 501st Troop Pack little walker guy thing. Chris Walker. Haha! -ha. Isn't that funny? Anyways, uh, you could have a clone trooper at the top here, just Riding along, we'll take off his weapon for this one. You can have him riding along, you could also plug this weapon onto the back if you want for storage, so that's a nice thing. But I want to have all the clone troopers right here, right in front of me right now, because they're cool. So yeah, that is pretty much it. Um, I guess there's not really much else to say except look at this set. Look at it. With two droids trying to battle at it. Yeah, you guys uh, have fun with that. But uh, yeah, the clone troopers are awesome. The set is awesome. Very cool. With that out of the way, please like, comment, share, subscribe, and all this fun dudes. And we'll see you guys next time.